Hey guys, another episode of Outdoors with T. Tommy here. Uh, did some foraging. You guys see me uh, do some harvesting on some pheasant backs a while back. And I just wanted to show you how I prep and cook these. Got a nice sharp knife here and on these pheasant backs you want them when they're dark and when they're young. Sometimes you find them when they're still uh, pretty fresh even when they're big and they're still dark like this. And you can tell if your knife glides right through it like that, that's a pretty good mushroom. And if you have any trouble, just discard that part. But this is the pheasant back mushroom. These were wild and I harvested them on outdoors with tea. So as you can see, that one's cutting real nicely. Just like any other fresh mushroom. Same thing with that piece. Here my butter is starting to pop back there. Now this, that's hard. I don't want that. You don't want to cook that, that'll be tough. So that's the process that I do to figure out if my mushroom is good or not. So it's kind of hard. I'm going to take that outside part off. See if that's easier. Yeah, that's way easier. So I'll just keep that part. I'll get rid of this. I'm going to continue to do that. Oh yeah. Way better. Very easy. If it don't go through there easy, just discard the part. That isn't sliding through easy. That's pretty easy. It's still a little tough up there. I'll get rid of that. those pieces oh much better right through like butter that's what you want let's get rid of that piece we'll take all that real tender stuff I hope my elbow hasn't been in the way that whole time I'm sorry guys If it's wider, I usually just discard the wider stuff. There's one big piece. There you are guys, fresh pheasant back ready for the pan. Love y'all, thanks for tuning in and I'll have uh, how to fry it up here shortly, later.